The city of Tuscaloosa and the University of Alabama are catching some heat for giving their OK for a sorority to host a party where 600 plus people were expected to attend. WVUA 23's Chelsea Barton joins us live from the newsroom with more on this story. Chelsea. Well, Mike, that party was canceled just before it was set to begin on Tuesday, but that hasn't stopped the chatter about it. Kappa Delta sorority called off its farm party following complaints that the huge outdoor bash could spread the novel coronavirus. The party was set to be held on 14 acres of land off of Joe Malisham Parkway in Tuscaloosa. No. Yes. 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 No. Yes. License is approved. Good luck. Although coronavirus cases are on the rise nationwide, the Tuscaloosa City Council voted 4-2 to two on November 10th to approve a license that would have allowed for alcohol to be served at the party. District 5 Councilman Kip Tyner told us what secured his yes vote. The, the vendors went to great expense to make this as safe as possible. They're working in three shifts. 200 at a time. They had gotten special buses uh, to make to ensure that they would have social distancing on the buses. Um, they had said there would be 30, 45 minutes in between for um, sanitizing. Um, and it's in a 14 acre outdoor field. Prior to the council's approval, the University of Alabama signed off on the event as long as students abided by the state and local COVID-19 guidelines. And I don't want to start any rumors out here, but I'm sure there may be some litigation possibly because if the University of Alabama had said at the very beginning we are not going to favor this it wouldn't have happened it would have been over but the fact that they supported it made them move forward to the point this is just a few days away from the event and this company has spent all this money so I just felt like it was unfair because it's happening every day it's happening every night you know, uh, are you going to shut down every bar again? Are you going to shut down every restaurant again? Uh, because the same requirements that we require the restaurants and bars, we required of this group doing the KD party. In fact, if I had a daughter, I would much rather have been on a 14-acre farm than be in Rounders. UA students we spoke with today do not agree with the Capstone's decision to allow such an event to take place amid the pandemic. It's kind of ridiculous, and I feel like they say they're taking care of the well-being of students, but to permit something like that kind of contradicts what they're saying. It's very irresponsible that they're not thinking about all the damage they could do, like longevity-wise, as far as, you know, everywhere else they could spread it to. This is, I don't know. It seems like people just don't have empathy, really. And as far as we know, it was the sole decision of Kappa Delta Sorority to cancel this party. Reporting live from our newsroom tonight, I'm Chelsea Barton, WVUA 23 News. Very interesting story, Chelsea. Thank you.